Hello everyone, welcome to a very quick tutorial. This one was requested by Clansley, who asked the following good question. How would I overlap videos and have one fade out as the other fades in? Well, I just happen to have um, a video in which I already used this very technique, so let me show you. If you've watched completely to the end my Happy New Year video, um, at the end, I showed some uh, Andromeda footage and screenshot, um, and I used this exact technique. Here you can see it. So what I did is I had a um, video, and I have an image, but I didn't like the crossfade because my video uh, at the end, if you put a crossfade, it needs more time to, to actually do the crossfade, so you need to overlap them. So once they're overlapping, let me just remove these. All I just ended up doing is just put a cross dissolve at the end of this one and the beginning of this one. And then you have a crossfade between both. So that's one way. The second way is the same way you do um, specific fades in, a, in an audio file. But as you can see, you don't have the curve editor. It's not shown. So you need to click the media first, put the cursor, let's say here, opacity, put a marker, as soon as you do that, you have access to the Curves Editor. Open it, and you see your point. Go to the end of that video. And then put another marker. And as you can see, you have two marks. Just drop it. There you go. So you can remove this, and you're going to have the exact same effect. See? And you can do that for the this one too. Let's go to the beginning. Opacity, put a marker. You don't see it, but it's at the beginning, so just open it and go to the length you need, let's say this, drop the opacity, so now it's going to become visible as you go in, so, ta-da, so that's how you do it, thank you very much for your question, Clown Slay. if anyone else has questions, that's how you do it, thank you, have a good time, and good night.